Hi guys! I'm here again for another video about Minecraft. I heard the news about Pojav Launcher is not available on Play Store anymore, but someone want me to test this app. And this is what I'm using right now. But can it run Minecraft with shaders? I guess we'll see. So let's go buddies! On your browser, search for Zalith Launcher. Scroll down until you see the Releases button. This is the first release I think so it's completely normal if you encounter bugs and issues. Now to download this, just click the version down below. Click open and install it. Click agree and install. First we want to do here is to add account. Just click offline account and enter your username. Click return. Next we need to do is to download Minecraft version. Just click install new version and select the version you want to install. This time, we're going to try the latest version. And also, we're going to install Optifine Mod. It says do not install because it's still buggy, but still, we're going to try it. Now, it's downloading Minecraft and Optifine. Let's wait a bit. Don't click anything here. It's automatically install itself. Now click on the version and select Optifine. Let's go to Settings. Here, the only thing you need to do is to select the Render option. If your phone is Adrenal like mine, you can select Vulcan Zinc. For Molly devices, select Pan Frost. But honestly, you can try every option here. Now, in Vulcan Driver, we have a few options here which we will install later. For now, click Save. Go to Zalith Settings up right. Select Vulkan Renderer. We will install another driver later. Before that, turn this option first for better performance and FPS. And adjust the resolution to 7 to OP. Now, we will install driver that suits your device. Click the download button. Scroll down and you will see a few options here for different phones. Here I can't help you because we have different phone. So, you need to try what's working for your device. But for Adreno 600 versions, you can try this one. And for Adreno 700 versions, this one. Mine is Adreno 650, so I'll pick this one.
Install it. Now close all application including Zalith Launcher. Now we have the new graphics driver available. If you experience crashing, just install another driver until it works fine. In Optifine settings, select the new driver we installed. Click Save. Next thing is to import shaders inside. Click Optifine settings and go to Shader Spec. Click the Add Files button and select the shaders you want to import. I have several shaders here I've downloaded before so let's test it. And let's enter the game. Remember that the app is still on its early stage. You probably face some issue while installing this new launcher. Just report any bugs and issue to the developers so they can fix it. It's a huge help for them if we report issue. So it's working, like the old Pojav launcher. Maybe this is the new Pojav launcher. I don't know, but using Optifine is not what it's used to be. Oh no, there's an error. It's because of the shaders I'm using. What the hell is that? I'm not sure if it's a bug or it's just like that. Haha, ha, I'm out of the camera. Still beautiful, like the old one. What I like in the new launcher is, you can adjust the resolution inside the game, which is great. That feels better.
Always remember, performance is based on your device's power. If you have low specs phone, this will be terrible. But if you have high end phone, that would be awesome. I know it's buggy, but give it time to update and this will be stable. Maybe other mods like Fabric or Forge will run better. But for now, let's wait for the update from the developers so it will be more stable and playable experience. So, what you think of the new launcher? Will it be better than Pojiv launcher? Or it's still the king? Tell me in the comments.